Good looking leg, half hairy leg. Yeah, okay. Imagine that being full of hair. Ooh, look at these angles. Bright and early. How we doing, champ? Oh, you for my big day. Yes, honey. Hi, baby. Ooh, check those out. Second half setup now that the sun's setting. Yes. Good morning, welcome back to my channel. We are at LAX, we're chilling up in the Sky Lounge. It felt like the safest place to hang at the airport. Just waiting to board our flight for our baby moon. We're headed to Honolulu, Hawaii. I am so excited. It'll just be nice to get away. I literally haven't been to an airport or traveled in a year. I know, first world problems. A lot of people haven't traveled in a year, but it just felt like time. Right, honey? Look at you, you look like a king in that chair. Well, the gate process certainly was sped up. Oh, it was so quick. Like, they just decided to get people on planes. Yeah. yeah. We also got full on TMZ'd outside and inside. That was funny. He followed us with his camera all the way up to the gate, basically. Um, yeah, so if we find any of that footage, we'll plug it in here. Thanks, bro. Uh, Check the name tag this time? Yeah, right? <laughs> uh, it's you on here. Perfect. It's the last time. <laughs> Who would have the same P2 case cover? Denise Richards. Richards uh, <laughs> not, not shame on me, but whoops. Always check the tag. Some people have similar luggage. Hey, we are mask free, safely in our car gonna hit up Waikiki for lunch since we can't check into our hotel for a couple hours. I'm gonna go buy old, good old Duke's memories. Memories? <laughs> I mean, I wasn't there, but. <laughs> well, good food. Good food? Yeah. Got it. This is crazy how like quiet it is. All right, Waikiki, here we come. 20 minutes in and he's already working. Uh, cool. yeah, and don't wait Changed. Stop at a dry bar. I might get me some braids. I'm gonna go grab a bite to eat and just gonna listen to him work, I guess. Happy baby boo. Awesome phone. Now we get lunch. Gotta get the first stop right here. Got this bad boy.
just got to our room. Nice kitchen. Bed and living room. It's not what I expected. I think I was expecting more of the forgetting Sarah Marshall experience when I booked an ocean villa at Turtle Bay. However, the whole resort is closed. So, I get it, we're in a pandemic, but thought maybe like, you know, pool bar, could chill and have a mocktail, but um, literally everything is closed. So we're just gonna have to shut off for a few days and I guess maybe drive into town to find some fun things to do. Uh, I don't know, but Okay, so night one, well day one, you know, I'm glad we actually did Waikiki earlier, got lunch. Pretty sure I forgot to vlog because we were so hungry and the food was so good. Um, but saw a little bit of that and then came, checked in, you know, wasn't what we were expecting, but still beautiful. We're gonna do this for a couple nights North Shore and then go stay somewhere else, switch it up. Got some food to go, put on a movie chill and I think tomorrow we're gonna go paddle boarding so see you guys tomorrow well before I say see you tomorrow I gotta check out this food this looks so bomb excited to eat update this food from Lele's bomb seriously delicious you gotta try yours just drink it down with the camera I'm naked <laughs> He's only half dressed. <laughs> okay, um, I guess there's nothing else to vlog tonight, so for real, see you guys tomorrow. All right, <clears throat> we are going for breakfast. Good morning. Good morning, fam. Just a little update. We are isolated, alone in this world. <laughs> there is no room service and we need to fend for, for us. <laughs> Nobody feels bad for us. We're in Hawaii. We need to fend so for ourselves. There's no room service. We need to fend for ourselves and go out here and get some food. <laughs> Damn it. See you guys soon. Aloha. Aloha. Welcome to Waikiki. No, we're not in Waikiki. Ohana. We're in North Shore. We're in North Shore, Ohana. We're in North Shore where not a lot is going on. So. Holiday update. F ourselves. <laughs> we uh, we didn't. We may uh, or may not have read the fine print on the reservation. I saw may not, may not. Turtle Bay, and I was like, forgetting Sarah Marshall stayed there before. Love it. It's beautiful. The North Shore is one of my favorite places on all of the islands I've been to. Now in her defense. The the display photos when you click on this villa ocean it's okay Turtle Bay Ocean Villas. So hold on because just to fill in the story. Rewind. I went to book Turtle Bay Resort and it was blocked out until June. And I asked my friend who lived here and I was like, oh wow, I mean I guess they're just really busy. It's booked out. I didn't think the resort was closed. He's like, oh crazy, I guess it's booked out till June. But my sister found on Expedia that they had the ocean villas available. They had one, literally one. I was like, oh my God, we scored. Everything is booked out. There's one ocean view villa available. We gotta jump on it. Continue. Oh, we, we jumped, we, we jumped. jumped on it. We jumped on it, we rocked out. So much that it was non-refundable jumped. Oh yeah, there's a nice little clause in there, non-refundable. <laughs> so we jump on it, Shame. we come into Hawaii, <laughs> we land here, we fly. My biggest one is the fact that like the time, like we have a beautiful place in San Diego. Anyway, I digress. So we get here, baby moon and ready, Valentine's Day ready, and we rock up to the check-in gate. Nobody's there. Nobody's there. It's like an abandoned warehouse, a little <laughs> abandoned shack. I'm like, oh, this is cool. Rock up, there is massive, just do not enter into the resort. We're like, wait a second. 
The resort is under construction, has been under construction this whole <laughs> pandemic. And when you call the resort up, it says we're closed. So that should have been like an indicator. But we I, didn't call, we just booked the correct. one available. So we go ahead, <laughs> we rock up, then we couldn't even get into this place because there's apparently no serve, no reception on. Mm. Not, yeah, there's no, no reception front desk. desk, no front desk, no concierge service, no room service. Now, obviously, I'm sorry, we're bitching because we don't have no room service. Yes, I am. I just flew eight hours, eight hours traveling to get here. Anyway, it wasn't eight hours. It was five and a half. Five so and a half. Dramatic. Plus our drive, honey. Do the math. The drive was beautiful. I'll drive this island all. Well, you're about to because we're leaving this. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> that being said, it's a very beautiful family Airbnb. Yeah. It's just an, it's just it's just a community of villas attached to the property on the side of the property of Turtle Bay. On their on their photos it's got the villas, it's got the ocean, it's got the pool, and it's got photos of the resort. Like all the amenities and everything, which you know, yes, I know, for us, whatever. I I, I am used to traveling a lot. We have not traveled in a year. It's not for us. We thought we were staying at a resort. It's not a resort. It's I know, very but I'm just saying. So for you know this one and only vacation we're taking before baby, I wanted to lay out at a pool and have some mocktails and order a chicken sandwich and just like have that you know resort experience, which we're getting tomorrow. We are switching hotels. So we gave him a call. Hoping for a refund. We, uh, we gave him a call and said, look guys, like you knew what was up. This is why you don't do you know, refunds. And I spoke to the lady and here's the rule. When you guys have to talk to somebody, all right, you say your piece and then you stop talking. Okay, you get what you want, you just stop talking because now it's awkward on the phone. Now she knows I was, wasn't really happy. She doesn't know what to say or do because she doesn't know what she can do. But don't step in and help out that awkwardness. Just let her just sit with it. And I just sat with it. And <laughs> she was looking at me. Selfish. She's like, well, I don't know what to do. And she went quiet and I just stayed quiet. You stay quiet. The next person that talks gives up. They surrender. They, they come up with an idea. Except not really because she still said, you know, you can cancel your room for the second half of your trip. We'll put it back up. If it rebooks, we'll refund you your money. Yeah, but I just said to her, I said, look, so I'm going to call up our card company. Let them know that we were just, they were bamboozled. Good old and Max. They'll just go ahead and reimburse us. So I'd like to work with you guys. We're gonna stay for two days in this Airbnb that's expensive as hell. And then we're gonna go ahead and just go to the Disney Resort. That's the camera's way of saying shut up, bro. Shut up, bro. We'll see you guys at breakfast. Bye, Felicia. <laughs> Well, thank God my diabetes test came back normal because that was a lot of sugar. This will be my only piece of banana bread on the island. <laughs> oh, what did you get here? Well, I got myself a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Yum. Some avocado toast. Smoothie. Cheers. Such a good breakfast. Beautiful day. Be in paradise. Rock is back to work. Decided to drive around the island for a bit. Look for something fun. Checking out some surf. Hey, Birdman. Look at you. All parroted out. All the boys got me covered. <laughs> Devoured our food and also his drink. 
<laughs> so much good flesh on there. Good flesh. <laughs> oh, there's so many of them. Hi, guys. Do you want some tortilla? <laughs> you see that, honey? No. <laughs> so. Please do not feed the birds. All my name is dropping. I'm going to wrap one up. Whoops. Thanks, honey. Wow, first class. Thank you. A little bit more of a pillow. Oh yeah, you to sit up. Oh, it's so difficult. I got you. <laughs> Full belly nowadays. Hey, baby. Got ourselves a little date night. Yeah. Double dipping on the mass here. <laughs> and uh, we're gonna try and weasel our way into a table somewhere because- We made no reservations and no plans. No plans, no reservations. Nothing's open in North Shore. So we drove into Waikiki and uh, we'll figure it out, baby. Wish us luck. So I thought heels were a good idea because Nothing else really goes with this outfit, but five steps in, I already have a blister, so thank you. Show I'm sitting, right. show up where I'm sitting. Oh yeah. Excuse me, ma'am. How do I get to the hula bar? So many people come up and ask me for directions. I was like, I don't work here. I just needed to sit down because I'm pregnant. <laughs> Back at our spot. Aloha, good morning. We're back at the sunrise track. Getting a little breakfast before we switch hotels. We're gonna go and try um, to have better chances today and walk into a place, hear some live music for lunch and Wow. Don't feed the birds. <laughs> so, you know, last night was kind of a bust. Just did the window up. The food was still good though. Where? But, um, oh, I had um... a cheesecake. But it was just, you know, something we could do at home or anywhere else in America. So. <laughs> <laughs> Probably not gonna have better luck tonight because you know again Valentine's didn't make plans, Day. didn't make reservations. So now I'm in the Valentine's dog house. Day might end up being tomorrow. I'm in the dog purposes. house now because I don't have a place to go for dinner for Valentine's Day, and I should have thought about. And this. honestly, I don't really care about Valentine's Day. That's not a big deal to me. I just wanted to get dressed up, feel pretty and have like a nice night out while we're here, which might just have to wait until tomorrow, assuming we can even get a reservation then. So um, yeah, lesson learned. This is what I get for not planning. I'm always such a planner. I make a whole itinerary. I get everything set up ahead of time. And this time we're like, we'll just wing it. You know, it's probably not gonna be that crazy. We've, we, we, in our favor, we thought we were staying at a resort that has restaurants and room service. So let's make that very yeah, clear. That would have been my plan for tonight. Listen, I plan, at least I got a, a I plan Valentine's, I splurge and I got a gift. I put, I'm putting so much pressure on this <laughs> gift. But <laughs> at least out of all things, I got you something for Valentine's Day. Well, you didn't have to do that. And that is, a, that's, a, like, that's a new one for me. I don't normally do that. Yeah. So we're good. What's the plan tonight? We'll figure we, it out. We have no plans for tonight, so stay tuned. Okay. Success. 
We did it. We only we had to wait 30 minutes. We finally got our uh, fairy drinks for the Hawaii. Cheers! Live music. I don't know if this is going to be copyright, but it's one of our favorite songs. Yeah, this might be copyrighted. Wait a second. I hope you don't mind. I hope you don't mind that I put that in words. Anyway. You can't copyright that terrible music. <laughs> that was horrifying. All right, well, we're wrapping up part one of our baby moon vlog. We are heading to our next destination. Stay tuned next week to find out if Valentine's Day, Valentine's night, day already worked out great. That was the best hey, day ever. Don't sound me short, ladies and gentlemen. If you think I'm gonna pull this off, come on, you saw me cook my uh, comment below. Yeah, you saw you <laughs> see, you see me you see me. Come on. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. We will be back next week with the second half of our baby moon and see what happens Valentine's for Valentine's night. night. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Uh subscribe. A lot of you don't do that. Like, ring the bell, say good day. Leave me a comment. Talk to me. Aloha. Mahala. Mm -hmm.